So I've already apologized to our internationally renowned yoga guru because it has been mayhem this morning, right? Please, she's, life is mayhem. That's right. Yes. She's cool as a cucumber. Jessamine Stanley with us this morning. And just kind of being around you, I mean, seriously, like, you're bringing the calm. This is oh. good. You know what's funny is that I am just as chaotic as anyone else. Like, I'm all over the place, have a million different ideas. And yoga is really the way that I find myself calmed. And so if I seem calm, not to be like that person who's like, I love yoga, but it's because of that. Right. Totally. Yeah. So talking about those benefits, you know, your book came across my desk and I, I love yoga. I believe in it. So in full disclosure, you know, I, I practice not as often as I should, but I've seen the benefits, right? Yes. And you're bringing that to people and you... You, you are a, a body positivity advocate? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, it's really an unintentional advocacy because very much my advocacy comes from the fact that as a fat-bodied, black, queer person, I have been taught to be very uncomfortable with my body and to apologize for it and to explain myself. And I see that kind of behavior in so many people. And it especially happens in a yoga context when you're in a, um, specifically when we're talking about asana, the poses, people become so intimidated by them because of their body type or because of their age or even frequently because of ethnicity or because of background to some degree, maybe um, maybe ability or anything like that. It always comes into play. And the reality is that this practice is truly for everyone. Mm. If you can breathe, you can do this practice. And so focusing attention on that has really allowed space for so many other people to see that this is something that can truly change your life. It's, it's a really well put together book and as I page through of course you know it handles it handles your journey that's woven in but it, it introduces everybody to a practice you know we're seeing some video there of you doing uh, some different postures tell yeah. us talk us through the book yeah so I wrote the book in a way that it is something that can be used by a complete novice like someone who maybe you've always been curious about yoga and it's something that you want to put in your life or maybe you tried it once and you were like I don't know if this is for me then the book is set up where you get to see step by step exactly how you can start to practice the tools that you need pro poses that you can practice sequences that you can work on but in addition to that you also get to hear my life story and understand why I started practicing yoga because so often people think that they're not good enough to practice that you have to be perfect or pious and I'm like that is not it at all and so even for people who have been practicing for decades it's very very awesome to see someone who is a real person and willing to be honest about that. So for everyone watching right now, we're here, we have our mats. Do you yes, have maybe yes, yes, one yes. to two uh, postures that you would advocate? Just give it a try. Absolutely. Let's get on our hands and knees. Okay. We can so, do that. Yeah. So we're going to do cat pose and cow pose. Mm -hmm. It's two separate poses, but linking them together, especially in the morning, your spine is going to thank you. So make sure you've got your hands under your shoulders, making sure you've got the knees under the hips mm -hmm. and kind of rock back and forth, spread the hands really wide. Get into your body because we're and really I'm turn sideways spending a lot of so time. Yeah, yeah, that's they dope. They can kind of see. Dope, 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 dope. And then on the inhale, we're going to drop the belly down, drop the heart down, let the gaze come up, keep the arms nice and strong. And then exhale, curl the spine, round the upper back, and shake out the head and the neck. Let's do that again. So on the inhale, drop the belly down, drop the heart down, let the gaze come up. Exhale, curl the spine, round the upper back, shake out the head and the neck. One more time, just like this. Inhale. Belly down, look forward, exhale, curl spine. And Jessamine, shake if out the is, hand and the neck. If this is the one move you do a day, I mean, this really is like, you know, it's so the good. perfect one. Let's shift back on the shins. Yeah, it's all about just getting into your body. And a lot of times, you know, you see the big poses and it's like, I could never do that. It starts with this. Inhale the arms up just from where you are. And then take your right hand on your left wrist and let's just drop on over to the left hand side stretch through the right side of the body. This is perfect if you're sitting at your desk and you get tight. Sometimes you have a coworker or something that's making you mad and you just need to take a moment, do the stretch, come back through the center. Oh, and let's take that to the other okay, side. Ready? Yeah. Left hand on the right wrist and then you just stretch it over to the right. And you can alternate that. I'm already feeling super Exactly, <laughs> yeah, yeah. And then you let the arms drop down. And then sometimes even just closing the eyes for a moment, tuning inside. And we always hear about, even though I'm talking while we're supposed to be tuning, <laughs> taking those deep breaths 
Sometimes mm. I find myself when I get all worked up, and my friends know that happens from time to time. When I um, panic, it's because I'm not breathing. That's right. Always. Take the breaths, Always. right? Always. Just take it. Mm. Inhaling deep through the nose. Exhale deep through the nose. Ten deep breaths before you cuss out your child or before you yell at your that partner. That never happens, Jessamine. It's <laughs> not that's like never been, happened. It never happened. Exactly. Thank you for being with us Thank today. Thank you for having Thank me. Thank you for being here. I've been so looking forward to meeting you. The book is beautiful. Now you have the chance to come out and meet Jessamine on Saturday. That's this weekend, June 10th, from 2 to 3.30 at the Richmond Public Library, 101 East Franklin Street. Jessamine Stanley's new book, Every Body Yoga, is going to be available. You get to meet this lovely lady, talk with her in person. Person. Feel the calm, feel the energy, feel it all. We're making it happen.